much. All right, we got to get to this big story. Dish Network Chairman Charlie Ergen has already found himself in hot water because investors are wondering what he's doing over the past year as it pertains to what we were just talking about with Pat Esser of Cox Cable, bidding on wireless spectrum. Well, the FCC deadline to jump into the 5G, which is what super fast speed, blazingly fast speed everybody's going for, is hitting. And Charlie Ergen is at the center of some very serious chatter. Charlie Gasparino has the inside yeah, I mean, scoop. Charlie, he, he, people he, are talking about that here, too. Yeah, I know. This is a big story. And, you know, he clearly, Charlie Ergen, the chairman of DISH, is clearly in the crosshairs of the FCC, F FCC Federal Communications Commission, uh, and its chairman, Ajit Pai, for the simple reason that over the last couple of years, or several years, he has bought wireless. He's bought wireless spectrum, essentially licenses, so he can build out a broadband, a wireless broadband network. Because you know he runs satellite. Right. Satellite is a, is not a great asset these days for, in this in this space. So he's trying to do something different. The problem he's got, he's got a deadline of 2020. The FCC to, to build this out and in a significant way, something that meets the FCC's requirements that it's a real wireless build out. The problem he has with the FCC is that they are very skeptical of what he's done so far and he's got a year to turn this around and he has and he hasn't shown much for it. Another problem that Charlie Ergen has is that if you look at his campaign contributions, he bet big on Hillary Clinton and the Democrats in recent years, particularly Hillary Clinton. The obvious reason people say, well, you know, is he a Democrat? I mean, a lot of people are speculating that he did that because he knew this wireless, this this broadband uh, build out would take a lot longer and he needs extensions or he needs some sort of forgiveness from the federal government. Well, guess what? He bet wrong politically. Now you got the Trump administration in there. So there's they're not in a forgiving move. So what does that mean for Charlie Ergen and for Dish? Look at Dish's shares since, I mean, that's one month, but man, look at it over the last five years. I mean, it's way off its 2014 highs, uh. which were something like $80 a share. It's, it's way off its yearly yeah. highs. I mean, the thing over a year, I think it's down like almost 50%, 45%. Uh, look at that. That's an ugly chart. So if you're a Dish shareholder, you have to keep this in mind over the next year. He, does he build this out? Does the FCC say it's not built out to meet our requirements? If they do that, they can rescind the licenses. That's billions of dollars flushed down wow, the drain really? by Charlie Ergen. Uh, we should point out that the FCC has no comment. We should point out that that dish, and there's been a lot of letters back and forth, or not a lot, at least one correspondence back and forth between the FCC and dish, and dish is saying it's done, it's basically, it's done everything right. We should put their, 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 their full uh, statement on the screen. It's worth, it's worth reading. And I will say one other thing, Liz, and we, sh we should put up their full screen. Can we get the full screen with their saying? Yes, thank you. Just want to make sure they have their side of the story. They believe that they've uh, hit their requirements. One other thing, as you said, uh, you, you were talking about the IPO story before. It's kind of interesting that, you know, Ajit Pai is not at the conference, right? Be because of the because of the government right. the government no. shutdown, right? That's number one. Number shutdown. two, guess what? Yes. There won't be any tech IPOs this year if they don't end the shutdown. You guys buried the lead. The shutdown is preventing the well, IPOs from happening because right, the SEC right. has and, to prove them. Tell you, yeah. The FCC, for all intents and purposes, is shut down, but it is interesting. They love those billions that come from these spectrums. Charlie, thank you very much.